Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah and good day. <coughs> this is an introduction to the volcanoes of Saudi Arabia. I was very surprised to, to learn that there are more than 2,000 volcanoes in Saudi Arabia and most of them, if not all of them, exist on the west coast of Saudi Arabia. They run fr from north to south and a long chain of volcano fields right down to Yemen and a 2,000 kilometer chain of, um, of uh, vo uh, volcano fields. There are 12 in total and here in this video I'm just going to very briefly describe 12, uh, 10 of them. 10 of them. So let's zoom in into the south of Saudi Arabia. The first one is right on the coast of Yemen and opposite one of the main towns, one of the main urban areas there called Jizen. And here's Jizen. And if we measure the distance from Jizen to the first volcano field called Jabal Yar, which is 45 kilometers. The next number two, going north to a small Red Sea town called Berk. If we can zoom out, it's called Harat al Berk volcano, and there's the small town of Berk. And the volcano itself is a hundred kilometers long, and it begins. The volcano field begins here and extends for a hundred kilometers to the to the small town of uh, El Harida. You can see. The main the town where you can visit the volcanoes is from El Burk, and it's another about 25 kilometers to the volcano field to visit the volcano field there. So that's number two. Number three, going north, is a ride out from from Jeddah. And here you can see the uh, the famous um, seaport of Jeddah there on the, on the left. Number five is called. Harat Kisp. And this is a, fa a famous volcano with lots of great features there. And the distance from Jeddah is um, 250 kilometers, so it's quite a long way in. The next one is number four El Harat al Rahat volcano field. This is a huge volcano field. And it starts just slightly, slightly south of the city of Medina, and extends for 300 and about 300, 320 kilometers, 350 kilometers, to the city of Taif. And that's a huge volcano. Number four, number five, number five is called Harat El Lunair, and this is slightly inland of a very beautiful town on the Red Sea coast called Omluj, which in the next 10 years or so is going to be very, very well known because lots of development happening there. And you can reach the Harat al Lunair and can visit this place. It's about, six, it's about 50 kilometers as the birds fly. If you drive, it's about 100, 100 kilometers too. And that's a very, very interesting uh, volcano field also to visit there. Number six. Number five. Number six is the Harat al Khayba. Harat al Khayba is the most popular volcano field in all of Saudi Arabia. It's north of the city of Medina, about a hundred and 2530 kilometers there and it contains a white volcano a black and white volcano and just people you know uh, produce beautiful pictures of that it's a stunt there stunning views there number seven is the Harat al Athnain volcano and this is if you look at Saudi Arabia this is central western Saudi Arabia so it's the it's the it's the most most eastern of all the um, the volcano fields, and it's measured in relation to 
uh, the central town of Hartiel. You can see Hartiel there. And again, it's 162 kilometers from that town if you're, if you're wishing to visit. Number eight is called the Harat El Awairid. And this is next to number nine, El Harat El Raha Volcano. And there are two, but it's, it's, it's almost like an extension of one long volcano. So Harat El Awairid can be visited from the northern town of El Wajh. And for the wedge, it's 130, 140, a, lot, a bit more because the very mountainous area, so it'll be a bit more if you're going to drive there. And number nine, El Harat Raha, Raha, is accessed from the town of Duba, which is the seaside town, the Red Sea coast town, and the road, the road goes in this direction. And that's 70, 80 as the bird flies. It's about 100 kilometers also for to drive. Number 10, and finally, the last volcano actually spans three countries. The south part of Syria, the central part of, um, of Jordan, and the northern part of Saudi Arabia. And the length of the Saudi part is... It's 200, 230 kilometers. So it's a very big, also a very big, almost fl almost flat um, volcano field. And this, the distance is measured from the northern town of Ara. So from Ara to get to that field would be about 160, let's say 160, 170 kilometers from Ara. So there we have it. 12, uh, 12 lava, lava fields, 12 volcano, volcanic fields, and here I've listed 10 of the, the most important ones. Okay, bye-bye.